and the Iowa Radio Association. Connor Rockholds, Riverdale, Iowa, has got the 442 Twinkie. Go! That's cool! That's a good one. I'm so glad he didn't come <laughs> <laughs> All right, get your raffle tickets out. Get your raffle tickets, your 50-50 raffle tickets. 503 dollars going to the winner. 503 to the winner. Ticket number 768-843. 768-843. You can claim your five hundred and three dollars wow. at the Cedar County Cattlemen's Beer Garden at the beer window just behind the Grand Stands. Don't claim your five hundred bucks. Yeah. Have to do it by midnight. The name of the bull. Former. Oh, Rudy Luna. Rick Flair is the name of the bull. Oh. What would Rick Flair say? That's right. Looks like old Loon is waiting on a club. That is, you know, there is something I've learned about living in the South. Is there is a clear difference between wrestling and wrestling. Wrestling and wrestling. Is it not just like one letter? No. It's a culture, buddy. A culture? Yes. Is there any wrestling fans in Tipton, Iowa tonight? How, how about wrestling fans? Uh, yeah, I don't know, buddy. There's a lot of real wrestling fans around yeah, here. Yeah, no joke. The corn fans. All right, we're going to switch it up and go to Chris Miller. Wilton, Iowa. Wilton, Iowa. Three is what we're inside. Come on. Firebrand 19, this is a bowl that is unwitting from the Honey Creek team. When a bull doesn't have a name, it's because nobody has conquered the beast. And when you conquer the beast, you get to name the beast. Okay, go. That's the rules of the rodeo. We say thank you to Iowa Travers. Oh, wow. Oh. That is a good It's like He likes to get it on. Oh, go. Come on. Good. Stretch him out. No good for Ruby tonight. <laughs> That'd be disgusting. If you throw up a corn dog, I'm going to throw up what I have for lunch. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Hold on. So don't, <laughs> don't forget, tomorrow night, the truck and trailer, or truck and trailer, truck and tractor pulls. Oh, the, the one that I like. Sorry, I was really hoping you were going to fall just like you did. That's why I talked. What are you doing? <laughs> You're going to be a horse. You're going to be a horse. <laughs> 
I had it. The whole panel face has already bucked that guy off today. Good one. That one. <laughs> the horse. <laughs> Can we do that? Yeah. The horse kid. No, but they've got ropes that can hook you around the feet. I can't see anything, so. <laughs> yeah. But you can't that. see. <laughs> oh, no. What happened? You're in trouble. <laughs> this is what we call Western justice, buddy. <laughs> I need a red flag. No, no, no. What? You picked a fight, now you gotta pay the price. I ain't paying the price for nothing. You do? Yeah. I got twenty dollars if you take him to the outside of that pit. I got twenty dollars if you take me out that way. Wait, no, that's it. Don't you even Hey, you're gonna be nice about it. No, Derek? Do no. it! Derek, who said you were hurt? He was right. That did hurt like a. I'm hurt. We're gonna need a chisel plow to fix our arena before tomorrow night. I don't have any worms anymore. I bet you don't. Ow. That's embarrassing. I left the skip mark all the way back there. You oh, win there, really. I'm, still, I'm live. Whoops. Luke Gusman, Riverside, Iowa. Wow. Whitey's the name of the bull. This guy, we talked about wrestling. This is an Iowa high school state finals wrestling contest. Wow. This guy has put a lot on the, on the mats at the high school level. Go! Go! Oh. 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 Alliance a year ago and made all of us threats. Would you say hello to the one and only Garrett Grove? Woo! This next man has dreamed of nothing more than protecting bull riders since he was a wee little child. He has grown into a great big man, and he is a champion among champions. It's the smiling one, Dakota Deeringer. Wow. That's amazing. The next man has been featured at the United Bullfighting Tour Finals in Fort Worth, Texas. Wow. He has fought at the PRCA Permit Challenge in Las Vegas, Nevada. He is from Leon, Iowa. How about it for Colton Johnson? Wow. All right. Max Hoover. Pilgrim. This is a little black bull. He go. But he likes to jump. There you go. With the barrel. Do it. Do it. Do it. Do it. Do it. No, the bone. <laughs> you know what's bad is even the bull doesn't want to get near you. <laughs> oh, thanks. Is it the dashing good looks? Could be the unibrow. <laughs> The unibrow. I yep. shaved that last week. Oh, okay. Well, you might need to do that more often. I think if I wore my shiitake outfit out more. No, I don't think you should. You know what's really embarrassing? What? The shorts I was wearing belong to a 10-year-old girl. I'm sure oh, they do. Oh and she would probably want to like them back. He's walking. She gave them to me. She said she outgrew them. <laughs> more embarrassing. Now that I say that out loud. <laughs> well, we introduced the bullfighters to you. How many of y'all have enjoyed Nikki Cobb, your rodeo entertainer? Yeah. Okay. What's that? Great that's Lake my... Circuit Finals bullfighter. Oh yeah, man of many towns. Add that to my resume. <laughs> yeah. It's not very long, but no, I got two things. What do you but have? I, I also have five frisbees. Frisbees! <laughs> Oh, 
While you're throwing those out, it's time to go to a man, Wes Warrington of Sheraton, Iowa. This is a man north of the age of 21, getting on balls for a living. He has drawn the ball, they call it boom. This is a blank ball. Wes has been there before. He knows what Boomer has in store. One big jump, and he's going to turn to the left. Wes, coming off of a broken leg. Come on. Good. Oh. And there's the broken leg. Stepped right in the middle of him. Folks, I mentioned to you, that man is over the age of 40. How about you? God bless all of you. Enjoy the rest of your Cedar County Fair. Uh, to get the ambulance uh, to the guy. Hello. Doing the same thing. Just look for one that they call the happy hippo. That's me. Watch all the tractor tomorrow. Pardon me? Tractor or truck? The semi truck. Now we're gonna hear we're here now with our pickup. Bye guys. We'll see you tomorrow night. See ya. Thank you. Don't drink any booze all night. <laughs> Have a I great got, night. I got two four-legged little ones at home that they're gonna be excited when I get there. I just yeah.